Well, hello and welcome back everyone. Huey here for episode 3 of my Civilization 6 Rise and Fall series. Uh, getting getting in a series before the uh, Gathering Storm expansion comes out. And we're playing as Japan and so far we've had a pretty awesome star. So let's keep going with it. And we should have our holy sites uh, up very soon. And I'm going to try and start working on the oracle so we can uh, get bonuses to our great person points. So let's throw down a mine. Oh, sorry, a quarry. There's our boost of masonry. And uh, yeah, let's uh, just keep going with it, shall we? Fifty-two turns until. Oh. But that's okay. That should greatly improve uh, when our city grows. Oh, if you excuse me one sec, I left my coffee on the counter, so I'll be right back. Sorry about that folks, can't uh, go without my coffee while playing Civ 6. So not much else we can do except uh, go for the next turn. And I think what I'm going to have to do is get a builder. Uh, possibly, uh, hmm. I might have to go for sailing, you know. Just so I can get a builder to explore these islands a bit. So I'd really like to meet another sieve. So getting that, uh, meeting that other sieve will give us a boost to riding, which will come in handy. If there are no dogs in heaven, then when I die, I want to go where they went. So there's animal husbandry. So let's choose our research. Uh, hmm. Yeah, it is telling us to do sailing. But then again, we are having housing issues, so I think pottery... I think we're going to ignore and get pottery, so we can possibly get some granaries going. And I want to steal this tile from Nan Madol before they get it. Hmm. Ah. Just what I needed. Right, let's send you guys in. Take out that barb camp before they cause us any real issues. Hopefully, he'll go this way and get taken out by. Oh no! Ow! That hurt. <laughs> State workforce, very nice. So we've got our holy site, <clears throat> and I want to take a pot shot with you first. Then you like we can do some considerable damage, if not kill this unit. Nice. So we got that, which means that barb camp should be taken care of. Okay, let's get started on the Oracle. Now, this is going to suck because it says 104 turns. Ugh. Um. You know what, let's get started on the Oracle and maybe switch to a granary along the way. Oh, it does grow in... What tiles are you working, actually? Huh. Yeah, production's pretty trash. Yeah, that sucks. Alright. I'm just gonna have to live with it. So, very, apologies for those very loud vehicles. Oh. There's our second holy site. 
And let's grab this. Okay, so there's, uh, we'll be into a golden age in the uh, next era. Let's maybe there, so you can't get hit by the quadrireme. Quadrireme. <laughs> uh, so we'll choose production. Let's see. Uh, no, not a settler just yet. Hmm. Maybe a shrine? No. No, 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 no. Perhaps another builder, actually. I think, yes, a builder. Because maybe instead of buying that tile, I can purchase this. Yeah, this cattle tile up here to improve our production. Yeah, so let's do that. Let's see how much this is going to cost us. 285. I think we've got to do it, though. I mean, that will solve our housing issues. Temporarily, of course. Hey there, Mr. Scout. Bye-bye, Mr. Scout. Yeah, crack him over the head. Don't kill the dog though, because that, that would be cruel. Uh, yeah, you can go in there and just fortify. And I think... Hmm. Well, it's only this holy site. It's only 27 turns, which isn't bad for this speed. We're only going to get plus one though, so... No matter where we put it. So, desert tiles as good a place as any. Next turn. Alright, now let's see where we are with our standings. Science victory, fourth place, which isn't bad actually. Uh, third place for religion. So, how are the great prophet generation? Oh, damn! Though we are getting four great prophet uh, points per turn. So, if we're lucky, we can catch them. Unless, of course, I'm going to build Stonehenge before we do. Kind of glad we're building these uh, extra holy salts now. Alright, that's good. These uh, two cities are now linked up, water-wise. Uh, so we needed 285 to buy this tile. And we've got a builder coming out in 31 turns. Takazaki. Mm, 42 turns, uh, that sucks. Yeah, thank goodness for uh, Japan's bonus here. If you play your cards right, playing as Japan, you're almost guaranteed a religion. So I think what we're going to do here, when this builder comes out, <coughs> excuse me, build a pasture here, do the jade here, and then pasture up there. Sounds like a plan. Just hang it for me. So I'm not far off being able to buy that tile. 
actually since that expanded that might be a little bit more expensive than uh, it initially showed so let's have a look no it hasn't gone up yet Okay, let's buy that tile quickly, if we can. Yes, we can. Very good. Well, maybe I just go for the... Oh, horses. So I'll go horses, pasture, and then do a little bit of exploring with that builder so that if it does get captured, it's got one build left. Not that huge of an issue. So 18 turns till we get this holy site and 36 for this one. So it's a little bit slower the production in this city here, but that should improve considerably. Kyoto still needs more housing. Hmm. Yeah, so I think after pottery, I go for sailing. It was luxuries like air conditioning that brought down the Roman Empire. Mm. So there's With air empire. conditioning, their windows were shut. They couldn't hear the barbarians coming. So... I think... State workforce is going to be the best choice here. So let's appoint our governor. And I like to go for Pingala to catch up on the science. So, let's put him in Kyoto, maybe? Yeah, Kyoto for now. I can always move him later. So let's assign him. Let's turn. Um, and a lot of people rave about Magnus. Uh, Magnus is good, don't get me wrong. Um, although, I prefer to get Magnus a little bit later on. Fortunately we've got no sea resources uh, being worked just yet. Some of our cities are growing quite nicely. Takazaki's doing fairly well, actually. Yeah, it's, it's growing exponentially, actually. I mean, it's already caught up to... Yeah, just, it's going to overtake uh, Fuku, uh, Fukuoka, Fukuoka. Sorry if I butchered that, by the way. Uh, Shizuoka is going to overtake Kyoto. I thought Clay must feel happy so in the good potters. I think what I've got to do. Okay, that one's fine. It's uh, housing sucks, so let's change you to production. Yeah, that's much better. Okay, so it's saying either sailing or irrigation. I'm thinking sailing. 20 turns. That suits me. Because then the builder will come out in 17. I'm thinking there's a barb camp over here. 
this island. Don't think this is a very large landmass. I have no idea how close we are to each of the poles, so I'm thinking we're probably somewhere in the middle, maybe? No idea. Anyway, so just keep going with it. So we're actually making pretty good science. I mean, all things considered, it's it's pretty, it's reasonable. So yeah, we have jumped uh, a place in science, so but we are suffering in culture, which is strange. How's those great profit points? Yeah, we are catching up, and we'll uh, definitely catch them once we get these other holy sites built. Fingers crossed we get them done uh, before Stonehenge, although uh, I don't see that happening. Oh, go away. Okay, so that's good. We've now got Uluru inside our borders. So Fukuoka could be, a, yeah, definitely a good uh, pyramid and or Petra City, definitely a good Petra City. So two more turns till we get our third holy site. Is a pretty powerful religious sieve. Well, that's the plan anyway. In ten turns, do we get our builder? So I think uh, I'm just going to bite the bullet. After sailing, I'm going to go for uh, riding. Uh, should I go for a warrior to get the mercenaries boost? Probably not just yet. I think what I need to do is go for a granary. Yeah. So I'm gonna have to start growing these cities a bit. I mean, and if I can get Oracle, which I should be able to, um, that'll help a lot later on for uh, great scientist points. Well, and every other uh, great person that's available. So, housing in Shikawaka and Takazaki has now got housing problems, although it doesn't seem to be suffering as much as the other cities. So Takazaki's going to overtake our biggest cities. A strong economy begins with a strong, well-educated workforce. Okay. So, an next civic really do want political philosophy, but, uh, hmm. You know what, I think I'm gonna start on political philosophy, and then I'm going to promote you so that uh, we can improve our campus buildings quicker. And that should do for Pingala for a while, and then we can probably get Magnus after that. Go away, Mr. Quadrarium. So we've got 218 gold stored up. It's probably worth buying another unit at some point soon. 
or saving it up for galley actually. Yeah, saving out. Yeah, I think I'll get the galley. How much is a galley? 65 production. It shouldn't be too expensive. Because, I mean, what's a warrior? Uh, let's see. 40 production. So, yeah, it shouldn't be too bad. Four turns until we get our builder, which I'm hanging for. And only six turns to our fourth holy site, so that's going to be huge. So what are we at now with uh, great profit production? Yeah, six great profit points per turn. No one's even coming close, so we should be able to manage. If not being the first religion, at least we'll get a religion. Uh, yeah, here. To, yes, I know, I know. I don't think I'm going to bother with the hanging gardens, I'm not even going to try. I'm pretty sure the AI is going to get it anyway. We do have... hmm... We could give Celestial, I think it's Celestial Navigation if we improve to sea resources. So after I build, build this holy site, I'm going to pump out another builder here. And try and get these approved. I mean, even if the Quadrarium there pillages them, then, you know, at least I can still get the, uh, the tech boost. Alright, let's go down. There we go, horseback riding, very nice. And... Actually, what are we going to do there? Shrine, government plaza, can't do a government plaza there, that sucks. Uh... Yeah, no, I think... I, I think... Another builder. Or maybe a granary. Hmm. Yeah, let's go for the granary. Oh, actually... Uh, hmm. No, let's, let's get the warrior out of the way for, so we can get that boost to mercenaries. Because then in two turns, oh yeah, in two turns I'll have access to sailing. Uh, yeah, no, you can go up there and grab that pasture for me, please. Okay, next turn again. So you can build a build up when you're done with the granary, I can start building uh, galleys. Go away. It is not that life ashore is distasteful to Okay. Well, it's telling us to go for a ride. Hmm. I am inclined to get it started. Or archery. We need archery just now, so let's at least get started on riding. And then, as I said, we'll use you to build a builder. It's going to take a considerable amount of time. That's okay. Actually, move you. 
put you there. You can go. Oh, God damn it. You move up there. Just hang there for me. And then you can go in there. What? Why did he go that way? Just... Yeah, hang there. You idiot. Alright. So we've got our pasture now. So yeah, that should help a lot. Just fortify for me. Builder to explore. This is risky, but I really need to meet another sieve. And or more city states. Okay, let's see who we can see. So they're going to keep churning out uh, barb ships if I'm not careful. So yeah, they really did, do need those galleys. Ah, good. He's gonna have a go out in the city. That's fine. Because I'm going to start... Hitting into you. So we can at least do a little bit of damage. Come on, I need to make it on the sieve. Somehow I think that Quadro Rim knows I'm up here. I don't know how, but it knows somehow. Uh, yeah, just go on alert. Alright, well, I think I'm going to leave that episode there. So that's been, yeah, it's not too bad. Not, not quite as good as the awesome starts that uh, we've had previously. But I can't complain too much. I'm pretty happy with that. Four cities, uh, as I said, by turn 100. So I can sort of ease up a little bit before I uh, pump out any more settlers. So, um, yeah, if you've enjoyed that, uh, again, you know, if you've enjoyed that, uh, that video, consider giving me a thumbs up uh, or even subscribing. 
but uh, until next time everyone take it easy and bye for now